Hello everyone and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. I'm a Wild Monty. In the last episode, a shit ton happened. We rescued Tetra, Icon, Legend. Uh, Errol got kidnapped. We set out to find her from Offset Island. And we got here to the Forsaken Fortress and we lost our sword. So it's just been a big, big, it was a big, it was a big week last week. Um, and now we are, I'm going through the Forsaken Fortress trying to figure out where to go, who to talk to, what is going on. I don't really know what's happening. It seems like on the first floor there are a couple items that could be fun to get, but... I'm just exploring. I The goal is to get through the Forsaken Fortress. Now I, the days of me recording back to back have long, okay. Oh, nice. So when you go out, it just gives a nice little update about where we are in relation to up there. Oh, hold on. That's, we're kind of in a in a nice spot, aren't we? Where where are we going? Will the searchlight hit us? Oh shit. Maybe it might hit us actually. Hold on. Hold on. What's Tet what's Tetra gotta say? Listen up, Long. There's a monster running the searchlight up there. If you can slay the monster, then just maybe it'll shut the searching light down. Oh, but you're unarmed, aren't you? All you have is a shield. If I were you, I'd use my shield to deflect the monster's blows and see if I could make it drop its weapon. If you did that, you could pick up its weapon with blah, but that's just me. What'll you do? I think I'll do that, girl. Girly Q, I think I'm gonna do that. Um, but we, I can't really do that right now because I can't get up. Oh, maybe, maybe this side. But yeah, I'm not really in my, my days of recording back to back are long behind me, but I was having so much fun that I am recording back to back today because this is this is so much fun. Also, can I I forgot how to get my my um ah, I guess I can have this too. I was like I forgot how to get my shield out. I don't know how to get my shield out, but I guess it doesn't really matter cuz I have like a stick now. Um and yeah, you you bring your searchlights up here. Can I Oi, can I, I don't remember how to do my shield. Help, help, give me this, give me this. Give me this, help me, help me, help me. Can you, can you die? Can you, can you go, can you go away please? Thank you. Look at that, and a rupee and a quarter heart gone. Um, is there, do they just, does it just hang out up here then? Okay, so it seems like the goal is now to shut off all of these lights. And, um, can I, can I toss that? Nope, I don't want to look around. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Um, but it looks like we cannot get over there. So I would like, oh, you know, actually, maybe I will. Does that, it does not. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna send, full send. Here we go. Here we go, let's see what's going on. Let's see if I can make it up. It looks like, oh, girl, I don't know why. Oh, cause my, no, I don't know why my Wii U keeps like disconnecting from the gamepad. That's very, very suspicious if you ask me. A little homophobic even. Um, but also this, this, sh my shield, I don't, it's like not, just not letting me take my shield out. I, I mean, I don't really remember how to, but you know, that's okay. As long as I have this stick, then I'm fine. Like it's not, as long as, as long as I have the stick, then it's not that bad. And it looks like this searchlight is also up, also closed. And then where's the last one? 
The last one is just right there. And how can I get there? That's the question. The question on everyone's... Oh, truly just down here. I cannot get up there. Okay. So if it's around there, then let's... Nope. Okay, we can throw those. That's what was happening earlier that I didn't really understand. But if it's just in there, then maybe through here? I don't know. I don't know what's going on exactly. Oh, we, we've been here. Hold on. Okay, let's go through this door then. Because I don't think... If we've been through one door, then we haven't been through the other. And then we can go through maybe... Look at that. Look at that. Spatial awareness for the win. We love. Just last episode, I was saying, I can't move through virtual spaces all that well. Aha. Gotta find, I was like, gotta find, gotta find my, my weapons. Where are my weapons? This feels very Breath of the Wild with the like, with the like, all right, just pick something up and swing it around. Hopefully it does some damage. The, it's very Breath of the Wild. Which, you know, that's... That's the Zelda game I've probably spent the most time with. So, like, I'm very comfortable with that. Very, very comfortable with that piece of it. Okay, so... Now that that is done... There's no more searchlights going around. Where... Where to now? <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Where to next? I'm going to come back down here. I, because there's no more searchlights, I kind of want to grab some rupees. If I'm being honest, why not? Why not grab some rupees? I know that's kind of what got me in the first, the first place. But now that there's no more, like, those are, those. 40 rupees right there. I don't know how big like the starting wallet is, but I mean 90 rupees on week three seems pretty good if you ask me. Okay, so where are we now? Um, I want to go this way because it's kind of hard. You can't really see the map on the TV because that's just sort of how... Ah, look at that. You can see it. Uh, but down here at that bottom, at this bottom corner, the one that doesn't connect through, there is a chest, it looks like. And I want to go see what that chest is. I want to see what's up. I want to see what's happening, what's hip and happening. Um, and I think that's just a route to the... Oh, gosh. Second floor. Um, I just want to go... Oh, gosh. Um, can I get in here? Thank you. Um, I would really just like to not be disturbed. I would like for you to not see me. Thank you very much. Please do not come near me. If you do, oh God, oh no, get away from me. Get away from me. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is stressful. Yep. Nope. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Don't worry. Nope. Absolutely nothing to see. Don't. Don't look at me. That's okay. Nothing to see here. Just a barrel slowly moving, slowly walking. I'm going to go around the edge when they start doing this shit oh once he's looking at me it is over it is not happening i don't want to get caught i don't want to go back i do not want to go back to the beginning uh you're a little too close for comfort for me to move um but i will start creeping because you are facing the other way and i want you both in sight. And I'm gonna I'm gonna make a little run for it. Making a run for it. Making a run for it. Making a run for it. We're going, we're going, we're going. Okay. Ooh. 
Okay, get out, out, out of here. Get out, get out, get out. Is this where I was? Is this... Help, this is literally the room that I was in. Okay. Any, anyways, what is going on here? Can I crouch? Okay, let's look at the map. There's, ah, there's something up top, it looks like. Ah, uh, yes, okay. A, a tad bit unfortunate. Maybe, maybe I will get myself caught so I can go in there. Um, Actually, I will just meet you on the other side. Um, nope. Okay. So that's what it looks like when you get almost get caught. Okay, yeah. I'll meet you on the other side of this room. I don't think anyone really needs to see me <laughs> doing the same shit again. So, see you on the other side. All right, I'm here. I know there's some enemies that dropped, um, but I don't want to deal with that. So we're going up here because I do believe that up here is a little bit better. Oh, oh, they're freaking out a little bit. Um, see, I don't really know how to get up. Oh, just like that. I was like, I don't really know how to get up here. You do it just like that. Okay. So I do want to go back to that room but I want to do it from up top. So retracing, time to retrace my steps and get there from up here. That's sort of how I'm going to go about this. I'm going to try and get, get the treasure chests, see what's going on. Um, I don't know if I ever said this. Oh, maybe I already did get this treasure chest. I don't really know. I don't know what's up. Um, I'm going to continue around this way because we did, I didn't really do that. I started to go around this way, but then I didn't finish. So I got sidetracked by turning off the searchlights. Sorry, sorry. I'm not good at focusing. And most of the time in games that I play, there's like a very clear objective. You gotta do this, collect this, go to this star, collect these mini kits. Uh, but here it's very much up to what you want to do. Ah, hold on. At any given moment. I So something I want to do is open this chest. That was, hello. Hello. Hello, this. So what do we have? Ah, yellow rupee. Ten, ten rupees. Okay. Oh. Hold on. Excuse me? What is that? What is going on up there? Can I come back? I would like to not get zapped again, please. Por favor. That would be really amazing to me and myself. Instead, I would like to just leave the room. I just want to get out of here. Get me out of here. Um, but yeah, I'm not good at focusing. What? Where can I, where can I push this to? Yep. Like what's going on, what's going on here? All right, it's gonna give us a, a little pan up to where we need to go. All right, so we're going up there. I don't really know, I don't really know exactly where to go from here. So, just searching, doing some, oh gosh, not more. Okay, it seems like I'm almost there. I wanna get into this barrel ASAP because, oh, heart attack, heart attack. Stream heart attack by Demi Lovato. Um, even though I haven't heard that song in years. All right, so what plans, where are we? While we're, while we're stealthing around, let's look and see. Uh, we see some maps. See some stuff. Let's try and peek around the corner, see what this dude's doing. Um, about to look at us, that's what he's doing. What's that mouse doing? I don't know. This is freaky, this is freaking me out. Where, what is that mouse up to? What's going on? 
what the fuck is going on in here on this day? I just want to save my sister. Is that so hard? I know they must have some like vision AI in them because when they're looking at, when they're not looking at me, it seems like I can get a lot closer to them or I can move a lot closer to them. So I wonder if it's really just like looking. Yeah. There, there's something about being close to them. So this, this section, tricky, tricky, tricky. I almost want to like whisper in here. Like, is it, is it wrong to like whisper? Ah, oh, no, no, stupid rat, stupid rat. All right, I guess I, meet you back there. Meet you back at that door, fuck. I hate that rat. Not too far. This, he, he's really the main one we gotta worry about here. For the moment, um, that, he looks far enough away that we can just sort of wait for him to go. This camera angle really makes it really nice. I, my strategy this time around is to just kind of stick close to the wall and just kind of wait for him to be on his way on the other side before I make make my moves. Um, I'm not really worrying too much about that other the other one yet. Um, just because this really is um, inches. We're we're inching along because uh, I want to get up to that door. I don't really care about. I know I said I was gonna explore everything, but I don't really care anymore. I kinda just wanna save, save my sister. I just kinda wanna save my sister. Like, is that so bad? Is that such a bad thing to want? Okay, I think we're officially kinda over worrying about him, and now we are worrying about this bestie. And obviously the rats, uh, if, we, if we encounter any more rats, which I really hope we don't. I hope there's no more rats. Uh, but I think, oh, you're just hanging out in the barrel with me. <laughs> just, okay, just push me back. That's, that's fine, I guess. Uh, but they're both looking the other way. So I think if I just poke around here, if I just stay back on this side, then he will neither clip into me or really look. I just am not really, yeah, there we go. And then once you get over there, then I'll uh, make it. I made it. I made it. I made it. Yes, we made it. Golf clap. Golf clap because it's still a stealth. Stealthy. We got to be stealthy and quiet. Now to find the sword. Where's the sword? Where's the sword? Where's my sword? That's the next little conundrum. Uh, where's the sword and where am I? On the map. Okay, I see myself on the map. I wish there was like a mini map. I really, really do. Oh my gosh, more being stealthy? Okay. All right. If you say so. If you say so, I guess I'll be I'll be stealthy again. Why are you coming over here? There's nothing to see over here. Go back. Go back to where you were. Go back to that other ledge. You can look out over the ocean or something. Like, I think it's a really, like, peaceful night. Like, look at that. Look at that view. Look at that view. Okay. Just gonna follow you. Follow you back. Slowly, slowly. You know, this is fine, but I definitely wish... <laughs> I wish this wasn't happening <laughs> right now. I wish things were... I had picked up just a little bit more. But, you know, it's all good. It's very different from most other Zelda stuff that I've seen. And I'm just gonna keep an eye backwards just to make sure that he's not really on our tracks at all. Um, but I don't think he is. I think I think he's far enough away that uh, maybe I can drop. Yeah, I'm, I'm dropping it. I'm dropping it. I'm dropping it. I think we're good. I think we're in the clear. 
for now. Peek around, peeking around these corners. Ah, this, this mechanic, this mechanic, this, what's it called? Seidel, Seidel mechanic. Oh, hold on. First of all, before, before this happens, I am going to push this block just because, just because, oh, well, never mind. I was like a little shortcut, but I just destroyed the shortcut. So, you know, live and learn. <laughs> Can't win them all. So I guess the one uh, strategy I have now is to not fall. No. Sits. Look at that. Look at how. Look at how great. Not falling. What is that camera angle? Oh my gosh. What? Hello. Can you climb? Thank you. I was like, look at how great not falling is going for me. Just going, amazing. Just absolutely spectacular. Okay. Try this again. Uh, excuse me. This is this is something else. All right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Deep breaths, deep breaths, <laughs> deep breaths, Monty, deep breaths, deep, deep, deep breaths. Okay. You know, as, as sort of like finicky as this, oh, you have to press A to keep doing that. Okay. That makes sense. As sort of finicky as this is, there haven't been any cutscenes, and those cutscenes, as much as I'm like enjoying the story so far, they've been a little rough on my, my voice is not, I am not. A voice actor. I'm not like trained. I'm not. I don't do any of this shit, any of that shit, like professionally, recreationally. Like, I don't do much of it at all. So, having to like not just remember. Oh, thank you for the health. So, not just having to remember the different voices, but also like perform those different voices every. Especially at the beginning of the game when it was so like cutscene heavy. What it was it was a little straining on my voice, I'm not even gonna lie. Ah, oh look at that, there's our sword. We get our get our sword back. Look at that. Hell yeah. Sword. Yay! Oh period, bitch. That's what I said too. Uh-uh. Yeah. Got back the hero's sword you dropped. Now you're in business. Take care not to drop it again. You know, easier said than done. Uh, can I, can I please use my, I would really like to actually use my sword instead of my telescope, but you know, you can always get what you want, but you can always get what you need if you try. Oh, what's this? Oh, period. First of all, that's cool, but I don't really want that. I want, I want this. I want to see what that is. What is that? I got a joy pendant. I can keep it in my spoils bag. These pendants are said to flock to those who spread joy, like butterflies to nectar-filled blossoms. Cute, I guess I spread joy. Does it bring you, does it spark joy, Marie Kondo? You know, I think it does spark joy, actually. If you ask me, joy sparked. But what's this? Oh, look, there's Errol. I was just, I was just talking about no cutscenes, and here we are. I'm gonna have to do, her voice is really hard to do. Oh, can you hear that? My controller, my Wii U gamepad, going crazy. Oh, the bird. Ooh, is this the first boss? Ah! Ah! Ah, that's a lot. That is a lot, what's going? Hello? Hello? Are we already at our first boss fight? I always forget if we fight, if we fight this freak now. What's going on? Who is that? Oh, oh my gosh. Ganon, Ganon! First Ganon sighting. Gripping my chair. Hmm. <laughs> Not the head nod. Not the head tilt. Oh gosh. Oh, that was a yeet if I've ever seen one. Where are we landing? Where are we going? 
Oh, we're just floating. How would we not drown? How would you not drown? Who is... What's... Hello? Hello? What's going on? Well, that's... Who's, who's speaking? Lonk. 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 Wake up, Lonk. Hey, listen. Pull yourself together, Lonk. I think I know who this is now, actually. I think I know. We're in a boat. Yeah. Bestie. <laughs> well, have you come to your senses yet? Bam. You are surprisingly dull-witted. Uh, I mean, you're a talking boat. Like, what do you expect? Did I startle you? I suppose that is only natural. As wide as the world is, I am the only boat upon it. I am the only boat upon it who can speak the words of men. I am the king of red lions. Do not fear. I am not your enemy. Lonk. I have been watching you since you went to the Forsaken Fortress to rescue your sister. I understand you have a desire to protect your sister. I have... Oh, I understand how your desire to protect your sister could give you courage to do... To fearlessly stand up to anything. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is... Ganon. He who obtained the power of the gods attempted to cover the land in darkness and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. He is the very same Ganon, the emperor of the dark realm the ancient legends speak of. I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now that Ganon has returned to the world, the world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Tell me, Lonk. Do you still wish to save your sister from him? Hell yeah. And do you wish... And will you do anything to save her? Hell yeah. I see. In that case, I shall guide you as we go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you must go. Ganon cannot be defeated by human hands, let alone by that... by what little strength you possess. Bitch, that's rude. The key to defeating Ganon is locked away within in a great power that you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? Hell fucking yes. In that case, we depart to the Great Sea. Ah, but I am getting ahead of myself. This is actually a bit embarrassing for me to admit, but although I am indeed a boat that possesses the power to, of speech... I possess no sail. And a boat without sail can sail no seas. I have brought you to the far east of the dark gaze of the Forsaken Fortress, on this island town of merchants who deal in a wide... On this island town... Oh my god! On this island is a town of merchants who deal in a wide variety of goods. If you search hard enough, surely you can find one who will sell you a sail. I am sorry to ask this of you, but without a sail, I will be useless to you. Period. Let's get a sail then. This island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. The information they provide you may come in handy during your endeavors at sea, so listen carefully to their words and heed them well. But remember, there is no time to play. Come back here immediately, as soon as your errands are done. Girl, this is a Zelda game. I don't have to do that. I can stay here as long as I want. Sorry. Sorry. Mm. All right, let's go find a sail. I don't think I'll find one in this episode, but hey, I'll explore a little bit. I'll see what's up here at Windfall. I'll do a quick little run around of the island, see what's going on. See what's going on. Oh, what's the matter, mister? Why are you looking at us like we're aliens or something weird like that? What? We're good girls. We don't spread rumors. Mm, are you sure about that? What? Can't you see we're busy? I know we're super cute and all, but that doesn't mean you can just come up and talk to us whenever you like. Cheapers. Spilled. Honestly, Miss Thing spilled. Girly Q spilled. 
All right, what's going on? What's, what's this? Is this a lighthouse or something similar? It looks like I will, I sure will, will sidle, see what's out here. I would like to, this is a little tricky to move the camera while you're doing that, but you know, it's, it's doable. Is there anything, is there something fun over here? Oh, just some pots with some rupees. Ooh, like always, rupees are never a bad thing to have. They really are not. All right, let's see. It looks like there are quite a few. It looks like we are much, much closer to where some fun things are. Um, but I think this is, I think we're, we'll be in this town a lot. So I don't really want to get too deep into looking for a sale. I kind of just want to do a quick little once through on the island, see what's going on. Oh, see someone dancing. See a little gang of children. Get away from me. I don't, I don't want to deal with children, but I want to get to as high up on this island as I possibly can and take a look around, see what's out there, what's around here. Okay, so we are just over there. There's a bunch of little shops. I wanna see if I can get up to that platform right over there. Let's see if that's possible. Do a little jump. Maybe, are there stairs? Over, hello. There's bad camera angles, that's for sure. Um, and there's running into walls. I wonder, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check in here, see if I can get up in there. And then from there, I'll probably call it just to see sort of what's up. Start, ah, some mini games. It's always nice to find some mini games. I'm sure that will be useful to keep note of in the future. Look at that. I think I found it. Ah, no, I don't really want to talk to, uh, maybe I do want to talk to you. Maybe you can get this thing moving. Oh, what's in, I actually do want to talk to you. See if you can get that moving. You know, this thing may look like a windmill, but it's actually a wind powered Ferris wheel. It, it used to harness the wind's power to spin in quite a nifty manner, but we rarely get any a forgivable wind around here anymore. So it doesn't budge. I'm pretty sure it's not broken or anything though. So if the wind blew in the right direction again, we'd ju just have to hit the power switch to get it back moving. Hmm, it looks like a westerly wind is blowing now. Girl, I don't know what's going on. All right. I think this is a good place to stop. We are in town. Oh, look at that. Can I, I cannot get in there. I like being right here. I think we're gonna stop. Thank you so much everyone for watching this episode of Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. In the next episode, we are going to find that sail. Uh, so if you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like. And if you want to see that sale finding, please consider subscribing. And I will see you next time. Peace out. That was a bad angle. Peace out. There we go. Haha. <laughs>